All right, Dusty, now time for, I think, your favorite part of the show. It's the Prime Cut Match of the Week. It involves Dave Sullivan against a young man by the name of Johnny Schwinger. Well, uh, speaking of my favorite time when we talk about Prime Cut, I know for a fact that all the young ladies, the young cows out there that are in the pastures watching this thing, it's their favorite time because that's the call of the big bull. That means that it's prime cut time and it's the prime match of the week. It's the best we got going and the American dream thousands wait to hear this. We're going to bring this one into this week's prime cut. Will be no exception. How do you how do you hold your breath that long anyway? I'll tell you what, you know, this is the prime cut. Match of the week, we're getting ready for it right here. Johnny Swinger, if you will. And look at Ralph the Rabbit. He's gonna face this man, Evad Dave Sullivan. He's got mirror vision. His name is Dave. Uh, how do you say Ralph backwards? They're all reaching for Ralph, and they're also gonna be reaching for his hat. You better watch out there, Evad. Oh, what a cute little thing right here on the Prime Cut Match of the Week. That's beauty. That's what it's all about at WCW. Yes, sir, they all turn out. Look at old Ralph. Ralph is waving at you, Chris. Wave back at him. I, I, I am waving. Hey, this guy, don't get Ralph on your bad side. How about a, how about a bow tie for Ralph? You know, that's not a bad idea. That's a good idea. Get a bow tie for Ralph. Then he can be bow tie Ralph. The bow tie rabbit. There's nothing like feeling the fur of a rabbit. Well, there isn't. Nice uh, and soft. Yeah, and well, who you been going out with? Yeah, I'm telling you. I guarantee you. Look at this now. Johnny Swinger. Great opportunity for Johnny Swinger right here. I mean, we've watched his career now start to come up just a little bit. Working hard in the gymnasium, if you will. And now facing the horror of Ralph the Rabbit and Eva. That looks like that Ebad right there on the back. Spells David. Look oh, at them children. No, it spells Dave. It doesn't. Dave. Yeah. <laughs> them children love Ralph the Rabbit. And look at this little house he got. It got a nice house for Ralph. Little WCW Ralph the Rabbit house. And you can see it's been shingled. Yeah. Got shingled cape that rain. Got rabbit food in there. But Ebad got to learn to lock the door. You know what he's I'm talking gonna about? He's going to make sure. I think he's yeah. made sure after that uh, fiasco with... Diamond Dallas Page, the new world television champion. He made sure that that door is locked. Johnny Springer looks very confident there. Well, here we go, right here in the prime cut match of the week. Getting ready to crank it up here with old Evad and Johnny Swinger. Evad is a big man, about six foot six, six foot seven. Oh, where'd you get that boy? Evad is a big man. <laughs> <laughs> He's a big man. And he pushes Johnny Swinger back. You know, he don't pay attention. Oh! You see what I'm saying? Ebad don't pay attention. He got to pay attention. If you could ever get him paying attention, as strong as he is, he could brutally attack you. No punches. See, he giving him a filibuster right down the corner. A filibuster? Yes, like them guys stand on the floor of Congress. Filibuster. I don't know what Johnny Swinger was doing there, but... Well, oh, he goes for a punch, and Dave told him no punches, no punches. I'll play fair with you, but no punches. Oh, oh, there you go. Here we go. Boom. Doing a little Ebad shuffle right there. Knocked him right down. Ebad trying to just uh, maul him, if you will. Right here on the prime cut. Match of the week right here on prime. Hooked him up real good. I thought he was going to go for the clothesline. He came up with the elbow. The surprisingly uh, swift decision there on the part of Ebad. Oh, look at that. High back body drop. Yeah, sit him for the ride right there. He batted control, got some great offense going for him. Looks good. I know Johnny Swinger really wants to make a good showing, but he's going to have to really battle out of this thing that he already got into. And now the whip into that turnbuckle. Oh, Swinger a lot faster than he batted. He moves out of the way. And now let's see what Swinger can do in terms of offense. Ooh, a rake of the eyes. And look at him go to the midsection there of Ebad. Well, that's what he's got to do. He's got to get him down now on all fours. Just what he's doing, choking, biting, screaming. Kicking him in the belly well, going for it, choking him, biting him, clouds him, get his eyes, do everything to him, hit the referee, do something, Johnny. You sound like you're giving Johnny Swinger some advice. Ooh. Well, I tell you, once you stop something, you got to go on with it if you back off. Now, see, he bad, like I say, not paying attention, backed off with this thing. And Johnny Swinger unceremoniously dumps Evad outside the ring. 
And Abad is probably wondering where he is, and Swinger is, well, he's thinking that he is on Easy Street right now. What is he doing? Well, he's doing a little swinging, you know. Oh! That's your man, Hexall! Hey, oh, oh, oh. And he's got them fifth day. What's he going to do? He's, I don't know what Hacksaw's doing here. He's not in this match. Hey, oh. hey, Swinger, turn around! He's bumping and grinding. Oh! Too late. Too late. Boy, Hacksaw just running around taping his fifth and hitting everybody. Hey, I, I don't quite understand what Evad... Cover him, Evad! Or what Hacksaw just did, I guess what he did is he helped Evad defeat Johnny Swinger. Well, he knocked him out is what he did. And he's saying to everybody, I'm going to knock you out when I take these fit. Look at Evad. Real happy over this victory. Ain't got a clue what went down. Look at it. We're Look gonna, it down, hey! Evad. We're going to have to... What a, what a face. We're going to have to take a look at that in our prime replay of the week, Dusty. Well, I'll tell you what, that's a happy man right there. And old Ralph got to be really joyed right here. WCW Prime Wrestling Replay of the Week. You see he was booging down. Hacksaw come in with his fifth tape out of the blue, making a statement to everybody. And then Evad gets in, puts up number one, gets a cover. One, two, three. Victory for Evad and Ralph. And we're back to the moment with some final words about next week's show. All right, that wraps up this week's edition of WCW Prime and Dusty as we look forward to Halloween Havoc from Detroit, Michigan. We've got Sting coming up next week here in the Prime, a debut on Prime of the American Males, Bunkhouse Buck and Dirty Dick Slater, Big Bubba, and the Nasty Boys. Can it get any better than WCW Prime? Did you in any of them papers that they sent you when we were at a break, did they say anything about the Disco Inferno being back next week? No, All right. Then we got a dynamite program on Prime next week. Bringing it to you right here, Sting Nasty Boys. Taking a hard, cold look at these guys' career. Getting ready for Halloween Havoc, if you will. And I know something, Mr. Bowtie Man. Can I ask you a favor? Anything. Anything. Would you bring me a, a bow tie to wear next week? <laughs> would you do this? Yeah, I'd bring it, but I know you wouldn't wear it. Yeah, I will. Okay, fans. I will wear a bow tie next week on this program. Don't get rid of your old disco ball. I'm Chris Cruz for the American Dream Dusty Rhodes Disco Ball. We'll see you next week on The Prime. <laughs>